We're learning a little bit more about John Carter. He's the man arrested for the murder of his then fiance, Caitlin Markham. Chancellor Wynn joins us live from the Butler County Jail with a closer look into who he is. Rob, Trisha, this is the Butler County Jail. We are live here because in that building, John Carter is behind bars following his arrest on Wednesday. Now, officers actually arrested Carter while he was teaching a glass blowing class. Now, tonight I spoke with a woman who about two months ago took a glass blowing class with Carter, and we spoke about his personality and her initial interactions with him. I've been doing this for about eight years now. Believe it or not, I actually started here by delivering a pizza. Oh, yeah. And I asked to volunteer my time, which became an internship I did for about nine months. This is video of John Carter teaching a glass blowing class in January. On Thursday night, I spoke with a woman who was in that class about Carter's personality. He was a nice guy. He was he was funny. He was genuine. Following Carter's arrest on Wednesday, he is now facing two counts of murder in connection to the death of his then fiance, Caitlin Markham, which raises even more questions for the woman who spent only a few hours in his class. How somebody who could do something so menaceful could also be somebody so chipper and nice and somebody that you would genu genuinely want to go like hang out with and possibly get a drink with or something. As she now looks back at pictures and videos from that class in January. Wow. And this is my career. I love wow. it. She tells me she's now left with an uneasy feeling. It really is just like an eerie feeling um, that I get thinking about it. It's just odd to think about anybody doing something like that and then going on years and years and years undetected with like a normal life as if everything is just hunky dory. First court appearance has not been scheduled just yet. Reporting live in Hamilton, Chancellor Wynn, Fox 19 Now. Uh, thanks, Chancellor. So Jessica Schmidt sat down with Caitlin's dad, Dave Markham, today talking about the news of John Carter's arrest. He says after 12 years of just waiting for answers, he feels a little bit of relief, a little validation now that Carter, Caitlin's then fiance, is the one sitting in jail accused of a murder. Pretty much always did believe that John was involved one way or another somehow. Um, this is a this is a little bit more reassuring that um, my suspicions, you know, weren't totally off base. You know, he has lived free for 12 years, and Caitlin has not, and he stole a lot, a lot from me, and a lot from her friends, and her family, and her life. It's really only the beginning of the court case. Carter has yet to appear before a judge. His bond has not even been set. And as for Dave, it's a step in the right direction, though. It's about time. And, and, and you know, I, I'm going to remain guarded and, and still pray and be hopeful. Um, and I've always said in God's time, I will know. And this might be God's time. Updated on all of the updates online and on air as soon as we hear anything else, we'll share it with you.